What is up guys? Welcome to another video. I hope that you guys are all doing good. Okay, before this video starts, do not forget to like, comment and share because it helps us out in the algorithm. So without further ado guys, let's get straight into today's video. I do have a very, very special video for you guys. Let's go. I look like shit. I just spent all night talking to my boyfriend of two like and a half years. Okay. Basically, there's been a girl, like a hot girl at his workplace. We both- Ooh, a hot girl. This is interesting. Kind of work together, but it's at his workplace. A hot girl. And I got mad at him for liking a foot. He liked a photo of her in a lace bra. Hmm. A year ago. Mm. And he was like, okay, I'll- If you like a photo on Instagram of a girl I don't know, in a bra, in a bikini, doesn't really matter because I've been there. I've been liking photos. I've done that so many times and I've gotten into so much trouble with my girlfriends because of that specific reason. So just try to keep it on the down low. You know, you can look at them, but try not to like them because that bothers them. That really, really bothers them. And she is still going on about it a year after. So that's, that's crazy. Stop liking photos of her. Um, let's see, Re like fast forward, um, they've been hanging out a lot. Okay. Yeah. And, and he was always hiding it. <laughs> yeah, he hide, he hid it. Um, ah, she shit. is just friend zoning him for sure. Like she's like way out of his league. I'm out, actually out of his league, but that's like a whole nother story. But she's like even more out of his league and he's just like, so he's he's hanging out with her and he's getting all excited and I'm the whole time I'm like bro I think you are you shouldn't be hanging like I the whole time every step of the way I'm like you shouldn't do this it should be us as friends like we should all be friends like let's <laughs> stop trying to you know da -da -da. I really like the fact that she has this like kind of like Michael Sarah awkwardness Second of all, there must be something there between the boyfriend and this girl. I think that they like each other and they're probably just trying to push her out of the frame and then maybe they can be together. I think that that is what's happening here. <laughs> right? And he's like, don't worry about it. Like, I'm not into her at all. She's awkward. She's weird. You know, she's whatever, right? Um, he, so let's fast forward. He ignores me a little mm. bit, like it seems a little off. Last night through the today, like it just seems a little bit off the texting and calling. Um, like for instance, last night he was like, what are you doing? And I was like, loving you. Cause I already knew something was off by the way. And he goes, thank you. And that was it. He was hanging out with her at his house. At his house, granted, Another one of his roommates, a girl, drove both of them home from work. Hot girls are women's kryptonite. A similar thing happened to me as well. You know, I have this friend and she's super attractive, right? And I started seeing this girl. We were seeing each other for three months. I remember as <laughs> the relationship is blossoming, she gets to meet my friend, right? And I explained it to her like, we're just friends, you know, we grew up together and there's really no sexual chemistry there. But she didn't want to believe it because this girl was so attractive. The day before that, I had told him to fully mm. stop hanging out with her because he was hanging out with her every single night out, out of work. And it was getting to, a, I was like, you, you have to stop. Like, mm. you have to mention me. You have to try to have like, whatever right and he was like i promise like it was like oh, but by the way he's paying for us to be in couples therapy right now he, like already and most of our couples therapy has ended up actually being about her already where i was like okay so who were you at that place with oh my god her see and the therapist is like okay hmm it's crazy <laughs> Women compared to men will do the exact same thing, but they will do it covertly and men will do it in front of you. So I think women hate the fact that we're kind of like dogs in a way where we just like, we just do. 
and we're not really covering our tracks. He's just doing it right in front of her. And the whole time he's like, no, no, mm. I really, I really don't. And he's like, he comes to my house and he's like, I have to tell you before we move on, I drove her home from work today because she doesn't have a car. She always needs rides from people. Mm. And there was no sexual tension. Like, I have to tell you that. I just want to be honest with you, like, right? Okay, let's fast forward. So he, there was, it was off, right? I call him tonight. He's like, <laughs> he's like acting really nonchalant, basically. Like he's acting off, oh. and he's like, so, and I, and I'm so perceptive at this point that I was like, digging, and I was like, I mean, what's going on though? Like you really seem off. Like there is, are you sure? For an hour, mm. he said there wasn't anything wrong. For an hour. Imagine she's digging for an hour. If we were doing this, we would be called manipulative, narcissist, psychopath. You're trying to manipulate me. But she can do this and post it on TikTok and everyone's just like, oh my God, you're so brave, baby. And then I go, during that hour, I was like, let's hang out tomorrow. Like I wanted him to come hang mm. out with me tonight. It's 7 a.m. now, so it's like hard to understand tomorrow and tonight. But I wanted to come hang out with me tonight after work. Literally oh my God, she reminds me so much of Michael Sarah. This is like Michael Sarah comedy. It's what Scott Pilgrim versus the world. She should have been like a character in that movie. Maybe for like hook, like for sexual reasons. Mm. Like I was actually gonna do that with this person, by the way. Like what? Because I thought we were in a good place. Wow, like that's how much girl, so, okay, there's something on my, okay, so <laughs> I go, uh, I wanted you to come over tonight, but like, all right, tomorrow night, let's do it, like tomorrow night, he goes, all right, I'll see, <laughs> the way our relationship is, there's no, there's nothing else, like, mm. he wants to hang out with me, like that, and there's a little bit of sexual frustration there. A little bit, because he's, he's not giving it to her. You know what I mean? He, I go, I'll see, what does that mean? Like, you don't know if you have to work? And he goes, no, I just, I have to see what else is going on. Tomorrow night, I was like, what else would be going on? Literally, like, this is real. Like, what else would be going on that you wouldn't want to hang out with me? Like, mm. what? and he kept being like, I don't know, I don't know. I just don't, <laughs> literally, literally. Do you say literally or literally? Literally. This really happened. So then about an hour in, I go, is there something you want to reveal? Like I really go and he goes and he gets silent for about five whole minutes. And he goes, this is so hard. This is so hard. Just like freaking out. And he goes, that girl. It's between, or he, well, he goes, I actually have feelings with, for someone else. Mm. Um, it's between you and, and them. He's playing 3D chess with her. He's hitting her biologically. See, the thing is like this, right? There are a lot of guys which spend all of their lives trying to accumulate a lot of money. And then they think that, okay, if I become this really rich guy or I spend a lot of time at the gym, then I'll be able to get the girls. But it has nothing to do with gymming or having a lot of money it just has to do with if other girls are attracted to you that's what it has to do with because if other girls are attracted to you that means that another girl has vetted you and if another girl vets you then all the girls are interested and that's how it works right so the highest form of chess that you can play with a woman is if other guys or not other guys other women are interested in you that is the highest form then secondary I have to say wealth strength kind of like peaks in but strength strength is not as important as women being interested in you. And I go, do I know them? And he goes, takes so long. He goes, yeah. And I go, is it this girl? And he goes, yes. Girl. They've been texting constantly mm. about work stuff. Like she thinks it's a you know friend thing right now, like honestly. And so they went to do some like, they went to do stuff after work together as like, she thinks it's a friend thing. Maybe, I think. I mean, I'm about to, as soon as she wakes up at 7 a.m., as soon as she wakes up, she's going to read my text and we're going to get to Oh my God, but that's like, funny. 
and I'm not mad at her. Like I'm, I'm like asking her for advice. You know what I mean? I'm girl coding it out. And, but, but we will see, like, I mean, maybe she was actually putting moves on because when they went over to his house, she asked to watch a movie, which I was like, damn, like, is she actually doing this right now? She wanted to watch. Okay. Wait, let me not get off. (sighs) They went to do stuff. Mm last night together and he realized during that that he definitely had feelings for her that's when he like really 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 was like oh shit i really do and then she goes tomorrow do you want to come with a with me and a group to a concert and you can actually bring christy that's what she said she she mentioned me by the way and he was literally going to go to the concert without me to be with her over me Bro, 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 bro. Like, bro, I'm, this is like, so this is a two year long nightmare coming to a head. Like, this is so, I could tell you more details. You know what I mean? Um, This is huge. (laughs) So I'm immediately telling her, like, I'm immediately telling, and he's like, don't tell her, right? Don't tell her, like, this will ruin my life. I was like, what, for her to know that you like her and that you're doing? Now that I think of it, it's weird. It's weird that he is telling her about this. Or it could be a play as well to just get her jealous, to just get her riled up. But then again, this has nothing to really do with him. It just has to do with the fact that she's way hotter than her. And she has a problem with that. And she's like, okay, how do I prove to everybody that I'm as attractive as this girl? Well, I need to win the guy back. I need to win my boyfriend's affection back. And that's why she's having all of this conflict. So it has really nothing to do with the boyfriend. It has to do with her attractiveness and how the group is going to view her because what she has colleagues. And I think there's probably people at work which have kind of picked up on this. So she's like, I don't want to lose this attractive fight or this attractive war to this new girl or this other girl because she's super hot and I'm going to be the ugly girl and no girl, no girl wants to be the ugly girl. A friend zone thing, like she knows that she's friends with me, like, Mm. like, okay, I'm like sweating now. This is my worst nightmare. This is like the craziest thing that's ever happened to me and I'm actually on here to tell you if you think like if you think that there's a girl like that there's a problem there is mm. and i can't tell you what to do about it at this, at this point because i haven't you know won the <laughs> war here <laughs> like all i know is that as soon as she wakes up she's gonna wake up oh to a bunch God, of texts of me being like funny this my boyfriend actually likes you mm. and i know all these you hung out there you hung out he has had feelings for you this whole time And like, first of all, obviously stop texting him and inviting him to things, please, right? But also help me, call me as soon as you wake up, please, oh my God, right? And he, by the way, doesn't want me to tell her, right? And he keeps threatening me. He's like, if you tell her, then it's over between us. And I was like. (laughs) But this is so weird. It's so weird, why even? have that conversation with her. Why not just dump her and then be with the other girl? Uh, bro, like, it's my life too. Like, I'm asking somebody, oh my God, I, like, I'm, wow, is all I can say. Like, if you are worried about the person, if you feel insecure, if you feel a lack of trust, even in the slightest, they can tell you no, they can deny it, they can say, don't worry about it, like forever and ever and ever. And it was, it's always, it was always going to end like this. And I really don't think that she's interested in him. So I think that this is just him being rejected by her. Like, I think that's what's going to happen. He's rejected by her. And then he like has to settle back with me. Or if he finds out that I texted her, he's going to like break <laughs> up with me. Bro, I'm in it. Two and a half years i'm a grown grown woman two and a half years and um 
maybe she does maybe she texts me i actually do like him because she is like that dumb she kind of is that dumb to be like i actually do though and i'd be like let me get out of the way then wow wow enjoy all the infections that he's gonna give you because his penis is disgusting and i have to get him to clean it every five Okay, I don't know about attacking his penis there, but uh, yeah, that's crazy. That is crazy. And I think the guy maybe should reconsider, reconsider his girlfriend there because she is a little crazy. But then again, I like girls which are a bit crazy. But leave it in the comment section, guys. What do you guys think? Do you think she's crazy? Do you think that... She is on to something. Or do you guys think maybe the guy's just going to get friend zoned and then run back to her? Oh, that's so embarrassing. That is so embarrassing. <laughs>